All right, so here's the rim installed. Check it out. It's on our test bench and everything looks great. Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be checking out the Laxar Ares DDR5 desktop memory. I did receive this product to review, but any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product, you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in the video description. You can see the retail box in packaging right here. Check it out, everything looks great. So this is the 32 gigabyte kit that features two 16 gigabyte sticks at 5200 megahertz for our speed. Now let's go ahead, let's open it up and look at the contents. Here are all the contents. We have our two identical sticks of RAM. Front and center, we have our Lexar logo and branding. Aries up at the top, DDR5 in the bottom corner. There's a nice top view of it. You can see it from both sides. Here's the back side, same thing. And now we have a sticker with some additional product information right there all of our pins at the bottom. That's everything that's included again. They're identical to each other. Now let's go ahead, let's get them installed. All right, so here's the RAM installed. Check it out, it's on our test bench and everything looks great. There's no RGB LEDs or anything like that on this RAM. You can see it from both sides. Everything looks great. Now let's go ahead, let's see how it performs against the competition. You've seen the data, the verdict is in. The Lexar Ares RAM performs slightly better overall in our benchmarking compared to the Corsair Vengeance DDR5, and both fall short of the Corsair Dominator RAM as expected because both the Lexar Ares and the Corsair Vengeance are running at 5200 megahertz, whereas the Corsair Dominator RAM's running at 56. 100 megahertz and costs substantially more than the 5200 megahertz counterparts. Now, even though the Lexar Ares outperforms just slightly the Corsair Vengeance at the time of this video, the Lexar Ares is about 40% more expensive than the Corsair Vengeance DDR5, and you're definitely not getting 40% greater performance. So just keep that in mind. Prices fluctuate all the time. So if they're the same price or around the same price, your best bet is gonna to be to go with the Lexar Ares RAM. But if you're seeing current discrepancies like we're seeing at the time of this video that are substantially more than maybe five, 10, 15, 20, and so on in price discrepancies, go ahead, go with the cheaper RAM. That will save you some money and you won't really be missing any performance.